Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How does a medical examiner determine cause of death? If you've ever watched a crime drama, you've probably seen a medical examiner in action. But how does a medical examiner determine the cause of death in real life? Let's dissect this, pun intended. Firstly, the medical examiner conducts an external examination. This involves checking the body for signs of trauma or disease that may have contributed to the person's death. They'll look at everything from head to toe, literally. Next, they may conduct an autopsy, which involves examining the person's internal organs. This can help identify diseases or injuries that aren't visible from the outside. It's like a deep dive into the body's mysteries. In some cases, the medical examiner may also take samples for toxicology tests. These tests can detect substances such as drugs or alcohol in the person's system. It's like a CSI lab in real life. Finally, the medical examiner combines all of this information to determine the cause of death. This could be anything from natural causes to homicide. It's a complex process that requires a lot of expertise and attention to detail. So, the next time you watch a crime drama, you'll have a better understanding of what those medical examiners are really doing. And remember, the truth is often stranger and more interesting than fiction. To learn more, check out these links which you can click in the description below and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.